Hey guys, before coming to Pink Street for the Lantern Festival, I did a little bit of research and I heard about these drinks here. So they have a marble inside and then you just pop them in, you drink it and then you get to keep the marble. So I'm just gonna give it a try. It's like a There's rabbit. A, it's a little marble in there. Press it down. And then down. Or wait, can I do this? Help. Okay. So we have to somebody just pointed that we have to do this and then press really hard. Press. <laughs> so there's that. <laughs> okay. Mmm, it's really good. It's like um ginger ale. How? Yeah. Mm. <laughs> well, that was funny. <laughs> yeah. Hey everyone, today we're going to talk about our experience last year applying to come and teach here in Taiwan. It was a little bit hectic, but don't worry, we're going to cover from beginning to getting a job. So to set the scene, we just finished our TEFL course in July and it was early August and we were doing the online section 40 hours and at the same time trying to apply for jobs. But we were, our rent only went to the end of September. Yeah, and we had also just uh, submitted uh, resignation letters, so we were like on a ticking clock. We had to leave by the end of October. And we were a bit rushed. We were told that, you know, usually it takes three months at least, and we only had two. So we were hoping for the best, and halfway through that time, we booked our flights around mid-August or so. Yeah, so from the moment we booked our flights to... The moment we had to go, it was about a month and a month and a bit. We asked everyone whether it was possible to do it in this amount of time with visa requirements or just paperwork in general. And I said, if you are diligent, you can do it. And we did. No worries there. We were able to finish it all up and this is the process we took for doing it. So while we were doing the course and finishing that, we started emailing and contacting as many people as possible. We had so many like people that we had to email. We made a big list and we included the video of like who we are and sort of like a demo of us teaching, our resume which we published. And if you haven't seen Yes's video, make sure to check it out here. He posted up on Monday. Yes. We also included a bit about ourselves, why we wanted to teach. Um, and just send it as many people as possible. Yeah, so we had that full complete package, which we think really helped having a, an example of our teaching demo, which meant that uh, when we actually did the interviews, people didn't ask as much. And then for having the little video explanation, they get a sense of who we were before actually interviewing us as well, which really, I think, helped set us apart. And the way we went about finding people is we had a whole list like we went online and Googled 